In this video, I want to talk about the key to success through visualization and self-talk. So we all have this self-image of ourselves, whether it's semi-conscious or unconscious, we perceive ourselves in a certain way and we, we, we think what we can't do, what we can do, our capabilities. And this oftentimes comes from what we heard throughout our life, how we were raised and just things we've picked up across our life. And it doesn't, and it most likely does not actually represent our true capabilities. And for a lot of people, it is limiting us. So if you want to achieve success, you may take the actions to achieve that success, but you'll reach a point of self-sabotage and it'll seem like a plateau you cannot cross. And this is likely because you are close to a breakthrough and your body causes you to self-sabotage because you cannot really raise above your self-image. I can give you an example. Let's say you're working to make $10,000 a month, but you perceive yourself as someone who makes $2,000 a month. That is how you perceive yourself. So when you raise above that $2,000 threshold or you take the actions to reach that goal, you will, you will self-sabotage and stay stuck because that is your self-image. Now, that's... That sucks, right? That's not so cool, you know? You may have picked up some some good stuff, some bad stuff, but essentially, all this self-image and things you picked up are kind of random. So how do you fix this? First is self-talk. There's an app called Self-Talk Plus. That's what I use. And it's programs and it repeats what it gives you a mindset of abundance. Like um, you have different programs. The one I listen to is called Super Coach. It covers like a lot of stuff, you know, like financial beliefs. And basically it uh, aligns your beliefs into something more abundance and what, and uh, it gives you the, the mindset you need to achieve your goals, success, and just happiness in life. It's good stuff. And yeah, I'll link that. I'll put that in the description. The other important thing you can do is visualization. So, you know how I said self-sabotage? It, it comes with resistance. It's when you're doing the right thing, but your body gives you resistance because you're going against your self image. So what you can do is visualization. So you lay down and you visualize your goals. And the point is that, I mean, you, you visualize your goals, you see your goals. And instead of at first, you'll feel resistance towards those goals. But you are going to visualize every day to the point where you become comfortable with these goals. You see these goals, let's say, and just a quick thing, one of my goals is to dunk a basketball, for example. If I visualize myself dunking a basketball, I don't want to feel resistance and think, oh, it's something I can't do, like unconsciously. I want it to feel normal. I want it to feel like it's something I can do and it feels natural. In reality, your brain can't tell the difference between something you imagine and something you live. Like, there's been some studies if you are to, once again for basketball, if you are to, you take two groups, one practices shooting the ball and the other practices um, in their mind shooting the ball, 
they get like similar results of improvement. So it shows how powerful visualization is. So yeah, visualize your goals. And not only is this going to remove the resistance, it is actually going to be positive. So let's say you see yourself as someone who makes a lot of money. When you're going to attempt to, let's say, make a decision or something that would be bad for your finances, you're actually going to get resistance for that because now your self-image is changed into something positive. So instead of the bad things being easy and the, and the good things being hard, it switches places. So doing what is going to make you rich becomes natural and easy and the things that make you poor or don't help your finances have more resistance and become harder to do. So I think this is something that, you know, is like a base, a platform. If you can work on this and work at it and make improvements on this, you'll have a nice base platform to then achieve whatever goal you want to achieve. So I think I've touched over what I've everything I've wanted to talk about. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments, what are your thoughts on this? And like and subscribe if this video helped you. This is really some simple stuff. Visualization, self talk. And these are simple things you just discipline yourself to do that. And you've got your base. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you very soon. Peace.